square plus 4 minus 0 16 and what's your ab 5 equal to this x square plus 16 scaring both sides 25 equal to x square plus 16 so 25 minus 16 equal to x square so 9 equal to x square so what's your x plus minus 3 anywhere given plus minus 3 yes given this is got or not so it's like this this origin is this so here also one more point whose coordinate are minus 3 and 0 so that's why plus minus came here if circle pass through this point 3 then pass through this minus 3 also so again like this same question repeating a b c d is what square and square is a quadrilateral whose all side are equal and each angle is equal to 90 degree and all square are parallelogram so diagonal also bisect each other and this angle 90 degree then this also we can find out so what's a point whose coordinate are 5 and p b is a point whose coordinates are 1 and 5 c is a point whose coordinates are 2 and 1 and D is a point whose coordinates are 6 and 2. So how can we find out? How can we find out? So two methods by which we can find out this question. How many methods? Two. Which, which, I can tell you. One time you can guess. You can guess. So one is by the stench formula we can find out. Other we can find out like this. And this. This is the midpoint of this. So what are this? 5 plus 2, 7 by 2. Other is what? P plus 1 by 2 and according to BD 6 plus 1 7 by 2 is this 5 plus 2 7 by 2 so P plus 1 by 2 equal to 7 by 2 so P plus 1 equal to 7 and P equal to 7 minus 1 how much 6 this is your answer understood if solving in competitive exam Another what? Another beta this. This I have taken A B. What I have taken? A B I have taken. A B equal to under the root. 5 minus 1, 4, 16 plus P minus 5. Whole scale. Then find out A D. A D equal to what? AD not BC we can find out. Or AD we can find out then also we can compare. AD 6 minus 5 1 square plus 2 minus P whole square. We can compare this like this or not. Yes. Both are equal. So under root 16 plus P minus 5 whole square is equal to. 1 plus 2 minus p whole scale. So 16 plus p minus 5 whole square equal to 1 plus 2 minus p whole square. But this is easy one. 16 plus p square plus 25 minus 10 p equal to 1 plus 4 plus p square minus 4p p square cancel p square it's meaning 41 minus 10p is equal to 5 minus 4p take in that side so 36 equal to minus 4p plus 10p so 36 is equal to 6p and p equal to 36 divided by 6 how much 6 any you can apply